Baker Mayfield or you're not going to pay Baker Mayfield? What do you do as a, if you were the GM, if it was actually your team, what are you doing there? Like, think about this for a second also. The revolving door of quarterback, they were the butt end of a joke. Right. You go, do you go back into that? So, it'd be easier to say yes, and you play the draft, if you were, you know, a kind of a bad team heading towards the top of the draft. But the Browns are where they're just good enough to be, like, in that 20 range back, right? Mm -hmm. So, they're not going to get a top pick. Or if you're trying to jump up to grab a guy, That's the other you're, part of that thing, you're right? shelling out lots of stuff, yep. right? Draft picks and, and, and stuff like that, players, whatever. So, yes, I think absolutely – you have to pay him now. You don't give him max like uh, Patrick Mahomes long term deal or Dak kind of deal. I think you do what the Cowboys tried to do with Dak at first: go a short deal, be like, "Hey, we need to really see a lot more from you, right?" right, right. Because we're running offense, right? They got two stud backs: Kareem Hunt, um, Nick Chubb, right? They can hand them off. They can do lots of damage to them, right? Mm -hmm. um, the Odell Beckham thing hasn't really worked. You know, he's kind of a I hate to say, it, but a game manager, really. You know, he's he's a a little bit better version of a game manager because he turns around, he hands the ball off, and he makes the short passes. Right? You don't count on Baker Mayfield to throw 500 yards and six touchdowns to win you a ball game, right? So, I think you pay, but in a small scale, because I mean, you're staring at 40 million. Hey, so you're answering this as in that's what you would do. Yes, you pay him. Right. You pay, you try to pay him eighteen million dollars a year or something like that, uh, for like two years and a team but, option. But will Baker do that? Because I that is know. not the going rate. No, like, absolutely and not. He knows that too. A starting quarterback is making right, and he's going to have more than that. He's going to, and, and unfortunately, that's what you push for. I think as the as the Browns, but yes, Baker's going to have all this leverage. I'm starting quarterback. I've done this and that. Yada yep, yada. Yep. And there's you know, not and there's not quarterbacks out there just on the right that you can get. So he knows. You know, the he's got all he's gonna have all the power ultimately. And and you know, the Browns are gonna have to unfortunately have to kind of play ball in his court. Um me personally I try to keep it on a short deal, you know, maybe incentivize it a lot, maybe to to go. drive that price up. You, you know, go. here's and see if you five thousand you know if you can get the best out of it. Right, here's forty five hundred yards, you get another whatever, five million, you know, whatever it is, and, and just kinda see because Involve. he's gonna take that jump. Here's here's two million.